Shalom, and welcome to the All Israel News Minute. Here are the top stories for today, March 11th. A delegation of 40 family members of hostages held by Hamas in Gaza will travel to New York to attend a special UN Security Council session on Hamas's sexual crimes committed during the October 7th massacre. The delegation, led by Foreign Minister Israel Katz, will also address a report detailing rapes and mutilations. This report was submitted by the UN Special Representatives on Sexual Violence and Conflict. The sister of a 23-year-old hostage says after international group failed to help the hostages, she will shout to be heard since the captives cannot. Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu had rejected criticism from U.S. President Joe Biden, saying that most Israelis support his policies. Netanyahu's comments came in response to Biden's statement that Israel's policies towards the Palestinians were leading the country down a dangerous path. Netanyahu argued that his government's policies were necessary to ensure Israel's security and that they enjoyed widespread support among the Israeli public. The exchange highlights the ongoing tensions between the U.S. and Israel over Israeli-Palestinian conflict. A recent poll by the Jewish People Policy Institute, JPPI, found that most Jewish Israelis believe U.S. President Joe Biden's support for Israel has weakened during the war in Gaza, with about a quarter believing that he does not support Israel at all. In contrast, most Israeli Arabs believe that Biden still supports Israel. Thank you for tuning in to the All Israel News Minute. For more updates, visit us at allisrael.com.